Hi, I'm here today to bring you the latest fashion tech news that you need to know. My name is Anina and I'm the CEO of 360 Fashion Network. Before we start, if you want to receive this news roundup regularly, then hit that like button and smash that follow as we will be bringing you this news every week to keep you in the know of the top stories we think are important. Alright, first up, Meta plans to take a 47.5% cut on each transaction of digital assets in Horizon Worlds. Creators will eventually be allowed to sell NFTs, but they are not too impressed by the platform fees. The 47.5% cut on every sale includes a hardware platform fee of 30% on sales made using the MetaQuest Store. Horizon Worlds will also charge a 17.5% fee on every sales transaction. NFT Marketplace OpenSea only charges a 2.5% cut, and LooksRare takes 2%. Meta CEO Mark Zuckerberg has previously criticized Apple for charging 30%. News source, CNBC, the decentralized cryptocurrency exchange company Uniswap will open a venture arm to invest in early-stage Web3 projects. The company is especially interested in startups concerned with developing blockchain infrastructures and consumer-facing apps. The newly inaugurated Uniswap Labs Ventures has not publicized the size of their fund, only that the crypto-native company would engage in both equity and token deals. Though the venture arm was only announced yesterday, the company has already invested in 11 startups, including Aave, Compound Protocol, Layer Zero, MakerDAO, PartyDAO, and Tinderly. News source, the defiant 82 million euros, 2.165 million dollar, fund called My World will provide 100,000 euros, 200,000 euro grants to creators working in screen-based immersive technologies. The announcement was made by Digital Catapult and the University of Bristol. News source, GMW3, the virtual micronation spanning the stateless. Three mile area between Serbia and Croatia is an architectural marvel with 3D designs constructed by the late Pritzker Prize winning Zaha Hadid's architectural firm. Vitjadliska founded the so called tiny country of Liberland, hoping that the metaverse experience could soon become a lived reality. By choosing an area unrecognized by the United Nations, Vitjadliska believes his techno futurist virtual metaverse can become a physical micronation. We can actually have two Liberlands one in physical reality and one in virtual space, Yudliska says. News source, Fast Company, Space Perspective, the Earth's leading luxury space flight experience company founded by the only female space travel entrepreneur, Jane Pointer, is revolutionizing space tourism and is a world away from rocket-fueled space endeavors. The elegant ascent in the climate-controlled, pressurized capsule, propelled by a state-of-the-art space balloon, enables passengers to safely glide for two hours at the edge of space, absorbing the phenomenal beauty of Earth in the vastness of space. Commercial flights aim for takeoff in late 2024, with 600 tickets sold to date. Space Perspective is currently taking reservations for 2025 and beyond, with the first year of seats completely reserved. Tickets are priced at $125,000 per person, and bookings are made with a fully refundable deposit beginning at $1,000. News source, Oat Living, and that's it for today. If you want to get the full top 10 fashion tech news items of the week, check out our new podcast 360 Fashion or go to 360 Fashion. Knit podcast or search for it on your favorite podcast platform. Don't forget to subscribe so that you won't miss our latest episode.